Hello everyone. Myself, I am Uma, and I have overall eight plus years of IT experience as a data analyst and four years of experience as a corporate trainer. I am a Microsoft certified data analyst currently working at Microsoft. Hi everyone. Welcome to KSA Data Vision YouTube channel. So in today's session, we will learn about parent and child DAX functions. So we will be learning about path function, path length, path contains, and path item. So this all belongs to parent and child DAX functions. So this will work on a hierarchy level. Example, this is the hierarchy. Okay. So case uh, data vision employee hierarchy. So the main head is Koti. Under him, there are two employees. Now Koti is also an employee of KSR. Okay. So he is the main uh, top level uh, employee. Under his, there are two report is who reports to Koti that is Mahesh and Krishna. So now under Mahesh again there are two employees who are reporting to Mahesh. So Mahesh is the manager for two people who are those Uma and Santosh for them he is the manager and to Uma there is a reporty he is Gopi. Gopi is reporting to Uma means Uma is the manager for Gopi and uh, for Santosh Judy is reporting means Santosh is the manager for Judy and for Uma and Santosh the manager is Mahesh and for Mahesh the manager is Koti. So there is one more employee whose manager is Koti but this Krishna is not having any reportees who is reporting to him. Okay. So this is the employee hierarchy. So when you want to work with this hierarchy level parent and child then you can use this parent and child functions. The same data is put into the form of table where we have this employee name and manager name. So Koti is the top level manager employee. So he is not having any manager. So it's blank here. And for Mahesh and Krishna, Koti is the manager. So for Mahesh, the manager name is Koti. For Krishna, the manager name is Koti. Okay. So whatever is there here, visually, which I am showing here in the right hand side, the same thing is put into this table. Employee name and their manager's name. So for Uma, Mahesh is the manager. And for Gopi, the manager is Uma. And for Santosh, the manager is Mahesh. And for Judy, the manager is Santosh. Okay, so this is employee name and manager name. Same data, this complete data I have loaded into Power BI. Okay, now I'll show the table as well. So this is the case of data vision table. And in this table, you are having this employees and manager names here. Yeah. Now let's try to create this functions okay now let's start using this path function so i will try to create one new column in this column i am trying to add employee hierarchy okay so for that i am using some function called path function so in this path function, I have to give the ID as well as the parent name. Okay. So here ID means I, I have only employee name. So I'm taking the employee name and parent for employee will be employee manager. So I'm taking the manager name and I'll try to close this function. I'll click on enter. Okay. Now if you see a new column is created. I have used path function. Two parameters I have passed. One is the child column and the parent column that is manager name. Now let's see what is created in this employee hierarchy. Let's go to the table view. Okay. So if you see this employee hierarchy for Koti, you are seeing only Koti. Okay. Because under him, there are no one, right? He is the top. Top parent, you will see under the parent child. And if that child is again having the sub child, you will see means parent here is manager name child here will be the employee name now here you can see for mahesh and koti you can see in a hierarchy the top is koti under koti he is mahesh same way for krishna and koti if you see koti and then you will see krishna and for uma and mahesh if you see first 
Uma will come. Then here Mahesh and after Mahesh here Koti also you are seeing because for Mahesh who is the manager, Koti is the manager. So you are seeing this. Okay. Now come back to this one. Gopi Uma. If you see here, Gopi here at the child, the last one is the last hierarchy means under gopi nobody is there right gopi is the last so gopi's name is coming for that manager is uma and uma's manager is mahesh mahesh manager is koti okay this is the hierarchy you are getting similar way for santosh and mahesh santosh manager is mahesh mahesh manager is koti okay so you are getting everything like a hierarchy top parent after that child, for that sub child, like that, you are getting the hierarchy here. The same way for the last column, also, you are getting like this. So, using path function, you can show this hierarchy level parent and child. Okay. This we have achieved using the function called path function. Now, there are few more functions related to this parent child. Let's see what are those functions. Now I'll create one more function that is path length. Okay, so I'll select here. I'll go for a new column. I'll give length of hierarchy. Okay, so here I'm using some function called path length function. And in this employee hierarchy, I want to know the length. Okay, so how many names are there in this hierarchy? That length I want. So for that, I am giving this column. That is the column which we created using the path function. That is employee hierarchy. I'll close this. Okay, now you can see the length of hierarchy. That is. 40 only one you are seeing so the length i have given here the spelling i'll just adjust this i'll click on enter if you see the length of hierarchy here only Koti is there so one you are seeing here Koti and mahesh two people are there so you are seeing two again here Koti and krishna so two you are seeing so the number of hierarchy levels of the employees you can see that length of that okay now there is also one more function in this parent child only let's see what is that function now again i want to create one column where in this i want to find out one employee name okay so let's take find employee uma okay i want to find the employee uma so i am trying to write one function that is path contains path contains here i have to give the path name and item name so from where i am i want to search uma from this hierarchy from in this path i want to search so i am giving this column that is employee hierarchy column and i will try to give the text item item is nothing but which one i am trying to search i am trying to search for a name that is uma Okay, so I'll give this. So wherever in this hierarchy you will see Uma, there you will get true, rest you will get as false. See, wherever you it is finding this Uma, right, in this column, because I'm, I have given employee hierarchy column. So in this, wherever the employee Uma is there, there it is giving the true value, rest all false value. Basically, this path contains will return a Boolean value, which is true or false. Since it is finding the name Uma, it is giving true, rest all the places it is giving false because nowhere Uma is coming here, right? So it's giving as a false. Okay. Now, there is one more function called path item. Okay. So let's try that function as well. So I'm uh, selecting this. I'm trying to give new column. I'm everywhere. I'm using new column, not a measure. Okay, because for every single record, the value changes. The value is different. So I'm using column, not a measure. Okay, so be careful while choosing between the column and the measure. Now I'm trying to take one more column. This is. 
let's find employee okay for that i am using the function called path item okay so in this path item i am going to search for the path so that path will be this column employee hierarchy column so from this column what i am going to search i am going to search for first position position it is asking so i will search for the first position and that first position also i wanted the text what is there in that first position the text i wanted okay so now i'll try to close it and i'll click on enter okay so in this employee hierarchy what is the first text first text is koti because he is the top manager right for everyone he is the head means he is the ceo of ksr data vision so that is why if i am trying to find i am just giving the position from which in this employee hierarchy column it is taking that position and in that position whatever the text is there it is giving so in all this the first position the value is koti that is why it is giving this function okay so all these are the parent and child dax functions which are path path length path contains and path item so all this we have achieved right so thanks for watching this and please do like share and subscribe to ksa data vision youtube channel for more informative videos and if you have any doubts or queries please comment in the comment box thank you